Ichimo here. I uh, had some friends ask me how I get Star Citizen and Voice Attack working together. Voice Attack is very simple. I just put links into the uh, description where you can download, vo download Voice Attack. I've also put a link in there where you can have a key map PDF file where you can print it so you know how the keys if you don't have them memorized. A voice attack works really simply. This is not a, a heavy tutorial. It's how to get it up and running as simple as possible. I have found that simple is better. You can put so much stuff in there that it can really get confusing to people, but this will get you up and running fast. First thing you'll want to do is go to Voice Attack's website and download the program. Uh, you get one profile for free if you want to do profiles for more than one game. It's best to pay the $10, and that way you can use it in any game you play. You can also use it on your computer. You can make profiles for anything for $10. First thing you'll do is download the program. Once you download it, install it. Just double click it, run it as admin. It'll give you a choice in, in, uh, in tools. When you first open it, it'll show you just like this. It will give you tips and tricks on how to use it. Close it. Being Star Citizens runs in admin mode. You'll want to set up that uh, voice recognition, voice attack runs in admin mode too. You can do everything you need. You've got hotkeys, you can bring it up. You can set your audio for your speakers, whatever you're using, your microphone, your recognition. It will do system info for you, pretty much everything. But make sure you run it as admin. Just right click the icon, set admin permission. Okay, now we got it set up. First thing you'll want to do is make a profile for whatever game you're using. If you uh, are using the free version, you only get one. It'll be called My Profile. You can rename it, but if you want to use more than one and you paid for the program, you'll want to create a new profile. Uh, we'll call this one Star Citizen. And we're good to go. Now, it will ask you when you first start it to run through the tutorial on speech recognition so the computer can learn your voice. I suggest you do it a couple different times. There's also a way you can fine tune your voice. If you're like me, you slur your, slur your words, words a little bit. It really makes a difference if you fine tune it after you make a few commands. Okay, first thing we do, we have Star Citizen as a profile name. We'll have new command. Uh, first command we'll give it, we'll say lock missiles. This will happen. You'll go down here where it says mouse. You'll have click. And we want to click the middle button. Hit OK. Now, we want to get fancy a little bit. We want to have um, the program respond to us so we know. So I can go to sounds, say something with text to speech. Uh, we'll, um, let's say, how about acquiring missile block? You can preview. Acquiring missile lock. Acquiring missile lock. Hit OK. That one's done. You don't have to do anything else. Say OK. Next command, new command. We'll say, uh, we'll say Fox 1. This is the same command. Click, click middle button. Okay, once again, we'll uh, do a sound reply. We'll do text to speech again. 
Let's just say firing this. Hit OK. That command done. Okay, let's uh, do something we'll use to set up really easy. We'll have when I say um, about nearest target or nearest enemy. To do that, first word is nearest. Get a space. We'll use both words, so we'll say nearest target. After target's in, put a semicolon. Hit space. And then we'll say enemy. I don't need to be capitalized. Just have it. Semicolon again. Make sure it's in there. Hit space. Close the bracket. Okay. Now let's do one more. Let's say you want to cycle enemy targets. What I say. Uh, cycle enemy targets. That'll be the Y key. It'll be a key press. Just go over here to press keys. Close this box. It'll tell you what you can do, what you can't do. Hit your Y key. Hit OK. Once again. <coughs> Excuse me. We'll, go, we'll have the sound so it knows it's cycling. We'll say cycling enemies. Cycling enemies. Okay, there's four easy commands. Okay, now if you're like me, you slur your words, you got an accent, English isn't your favorite language, and you have it in English, you can fine tune all these things so it understands you better. To do that, hit done here, close voice attack. Down here in Cortana, just type in speech recognition. Should come up and go speech recognition. Click on it to turn it on. Right click on it, go down to open speech dictionary. Once you do that, you can add a new word or you can change change it uh let's go ahead with uh uh whoops just trying to listen Record a pronunciation on finish. Hit record. Nearest enemy. Hit Nearest finish. enemy. Then hit finish. Go through that with every command you have given. Voice attack. And it will understand you better. Close speech recognition, reopen voice attack. Run voice attack once again in admin mode because Star Citizen is in admin mode. And if you don't have time, it won't hear you. It will tell you that it wants to close speech recognition even though you closed it. So obviously Windows has it set that it doesn't really close when you close it. You can turn these tips off, but it's best to read all the tutorial to learn more about it. Now we'll check. How about lock missile? Lock missile. Acquiring missile lock. Fox one. Firing missile. Nearest target. Nearest target. Nearest enemy. Got something wrong there. It's not unless I did not put in voice recognition. Let's see. Edit this command. No, we didn't. So we'll go through here. And we'll put in a sound, say something text to speech. Let's see. We'll just have her say nearest enemy. Hit 
okay. Don't see why now. Key press should be up there. Might have screwed up here. Let's delete, go back to key press. Nearest target is T. Put this. Hit OK. Now go back down here. Our voice attack on. Sound, say something for the text. Nearest enemy. Nearest enemy. Whoops. Close the edit window. Nearest enemy. Nearest enemy. Nearest target. Nearest enemy. And there you have it. Now that we've got all that, all we have to do is launch the game. Let's see. We'll pop in here to Vandal's Forum and check out our com simple commands. Vandal Swarm initiated. I'm back. Warning, there are multiple hostiles inbound. Nearest target. Nearest enemy. Lock missile. Acquiring missile lock. Fox one. Firing missile. And there you have it. You can use any command that's on the keyboard. Voice stick doesn't make any difference. You can make your own voice response, or you can just use sound technology. Lock missile. Lock missile. Acquiring missile lock. Fox one. Firing missile. There you have it. If you have any questions, you can't get it to work, just give me a reply and I'll try to work you through it. But it really adds a lot of immersion to the game and it really is a lot of fun. Nearest target. Taking fire. Nearest enemy.